Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your battery icon has disappeared from your notification area on Windows 10. So this is going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So there's a couple steps we're going to go through and a couple different alternative ways to hopefully fix this problem for you. So we're going to just jump right into it. And the first thing I would recommend would be to head over to the start button and you want to left click to open it up. And now you want to left click on the little icon that appears to be a gear right next, right above the power button. It should say settings when you hover over it. And you want to left click on it. So now you want to left click on the system tile, should be the first tile that comes up. And then there should be something on the left side that says notifications and actions. You want to left click on that. On the right side, there should be something that says power for you guys. Since I'm using a desktop computer, there is no battery, but there should be something that's around here, and you could rearrange them if you chose to do so. And by left clicking on add or remove quick actions by left clicking on that, there should be an option here that says power. If it's currently in the off position, you want to just left click inside this oval to turn it on. Again, you would access that by going underneath add or remove quick actions. The other alternative solution that should hopefully work if that one did not work for you would be to close out of the settings window. Go back to the start menu and type in device manager. Should be listed right above control panel. So you want to left click on that. Should be something that says batteries near the top. You want to expand this view by either double clicking on it or left clicking the little arrow on the left side. So whatever's listed here, you want to double click on it. So whatever options or batteries are listed here, you want to right click on them. Make sure they're enabled. So instead of it saying disable here, it would say enable. You want to click on the enable button because obviously it's enabled right now, that's why there's the disable option. But if it is disabled, there should be an option to enable. You want to enable it. I'd recommend trying that. And if that did not work and both solutions did not work for you, I'd recommend disabling it and then re enabling it. Just kind of do a reset in sorts. And then I recommend in between both of those, try restarting your computer. And hopefully the problem has been resolved. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.